Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Princess Michaela back here with another video. And today I'm unboxing something that I cannot wait to show you guys. I'm really, really excited to show you. So let's just get right into it. Okay, so I really wanted to to give you guys a little info session really quickly. Um, so right here I do have something I want to unbox, but it does have, you know, personal connection to me. So, you know, I do photography. I'm pretty sure I talk about it all the time. Um, and I actually went to SCAD. Now, the way my art school worked is we got to actually borrow or, you know, sign up and use the lens. And then you just bring it back at the designated time. So I would always try out new lenses to see how different lenses worked with my work and my camera and, you know, how everything feels. So I actually picked up this lens. Um, so I actually picked up a lens one day and I was actually shocked because the lens was perfect for me. It, was, it, it just seemed like it all worked together. So what I did was I created a few images and I brought them back to my teacher or my professor at the time who knew what my project was and knew what I wanted to do. And he saw my work and he was like, no one has ever used this kind of lens for the kind of work that you want to do. So what I did was, I'm like, well, I have a different kind of eye for this lens. I have a different kind of eye for photography. Why don't I just take it and add it to my, my collection? So the first lens I ever bought for my camera was actually a 50 millimeter 1.4. That's what I'm shooting on right now. And that's what I started on my work with, but I just wasn't, I was happy with the quality. I was happy with the results that I was getting, but I just wasn't happy with, it didn't seem like it fit for my work. So, you know, every, every artist has a medium or something that they work with that they really love that sets their work on to a new level. So I'm not saying that the lens that I do have is not perfect because I love it and it's done amazing work, but you know, I just have other preferences and things like that. So we're going to unbox something that I got today that I'm really excited for. So let's get right into it. I already cut it open because I was too excited when I got here. So the lens that I did go ahead and pick up is a Canon lens and it is the 16 to 35 f4 which is my favorite lens thus far so I'm just gonna start right now with just go ahead and talking a little bit about talking a little bit about the lens and everything like that so if you guys go ahead and check out my website it is michaeladaniel.com it's always linked in the description box below along with all my other social media follow me um, but yeah, so um, if you go ahead and look at my website, majority of the lifestyle work that's on my website is created with this lens. It's just something that I just picked up and I just started finding different angles and I found something that fits me and fits my style and fits something that I'm really, really happy about. So it's not that that is the only lens that I can use for what I do, but this is one of my favorite lenses that I use for what I do. So I went ahead and finally purchased it. I can go ahead and buy this. This lens does have image stabilization. But yeah, so this is how the lens looks. And we're gonna go ahead and start unboxing it. Now what I do love about it though, is that you do get all your packets and information like that. What I do love about the lens is for the type of work I would do, I loved how it gave me more in my view of the image and it's more to play with more more perspectives more things to work with things like that so once i first opened the camera i did show you all the paper it comes with this cover and everything the first thing you see is a bag that you can use that you use to store your camera I mean, store your lens. You use this bag to store your lens, and it's great for safe traveling. Then you open it up, and you get your lens hood. And then you get the bad boy right here. 
Okay, so the, the lens comes with the lens cap on the back, a lens cap on the front. This also has autofocus and manual focus, as well as Im image stabilization. Now, image stabilization on a lens is amazing. If you are looking for a lens and you're wanting to spend a little bit of money, definitely look into trying to get an image stabilization lens because if you're trying to do handheld work without a tripod, an uh, image stabilization will work great because it helps be the first buffer between shakiness in your videos. But thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. Um, all my Instagram and Twitter and everything like that is in the description box below. It's at Princess Michaela as well as Snapchat. So go ahead and add me and see you guys later. Thank you guys for watching and stay in tuned.